Hi everybody, this is ML Hats here and I'm doing another hat review. And if you've been watching my other videos, if you subscribe to my channel, I'm doing a series just on the Brave uh, Minor League Hats alone. So I'm going to continue this and we're going to be going on to the AAA team, the Gwinnett Braves slash the Gwinnett Stripers. I'm going to talk about both of them and what, what happened and why they changed the name. But in the meantime, as I like to get started with all my hat reviews, um, Major League Hat's most wanted hat for this week is the St. Lu Lucie Mets. It's the high A team of the Mets, as you can see. Uh, Litz has this hat, but they don't. They just don't have it in my size, so I just gotta wait. Uh, I tried to see if I could get one today. It was in like a all blue color, I think it was, but it was like twenty bucks. But they just didn't have it in my size, so I'll just have to keep waiting. Um, and it just hasn't been a high priority just because it's one of those letter hats that I typically don't like. So, you know, I try to get the other hats that I want first before I move on to just the letter hats. Uh, but I'll get it eventually because, you know, I got to get it to complete my set. All right, let's move on to, with our Brave series. Now to continue on with our Brave series, it brings us to the AAA level of the Atlanta Braves. Um, this hat is no longer used anymore or the name I should say, which is the Gwinnett Braves. I'll talk to you about that in just a moment and why they decided to change it. Um, but in the meantime, you know, just like I've talked about on the Mississippi Braves, they've always had the Braves name. The only time that they had a different name is when they were the Atlanta Crackers from 1901 to 1965. Then they became the Richmond Braves from 66 to 08. And then from 2009 to 2017, they were the Gwinnett Braves. Now with your standard Atlanta Braves theme going on, which is what I liked about it, is they have the G, nice standard G with the red lining on the outside of the G to highlight it. Then you have your tomahawk uh, chop going right through the G. And, you know, as you've seen in my other videos, like on the Mississippi Braves, it's like the exact same tomahawk. So I kind of like how they do that. You know, it makes it the it shows that they're both related, and uh, with their their affiliate. And then on the back, it's the exact same. Even on the Florida Fire Frogs, you have the red and the black uh, baseball minor league uh, guy in the back. So that's really cool. It's your standard 5950, so it's really comfortable. They did a really good job on the hat itself. Now this hat, like I said, it's no longer used. Uh, you could still probably get it online at lids.com. But I've had this hat for a couple years, and then as soon as they came out with the new AAA hat, I decided to get it. All right, so there's just not a lot to say about this hat. I don't wear it that much. You know, if you watch my other videos, if you subscribe to my channel, uh, you'll understand why I kind of don't wear it that much. Um, it's just not my preference, and I have a bunch of other hats that are, I really like to get out there and get noticed and everything. So, all right, let's move on with our Atlanta Braves series. So, uh, this is the Gwinnett Braves. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, set your notifications so you get notified when I upload new videos. And then if you want to follow me on Twitter and Instagram and see what I'm up to or what ballpark I'm visiting, please do that at MLHATS5950. That's M-L-H-A-T-Z at 5950. All right, this has been MLHATS out.